All right, today I got Lewis's DA Integra. He's about to pull it in, it's a little turbo LS. This ought to be cool, man. So it's a LSV Tech Dragon Fire distributor, looks like. But he's got the Burton coil on plug kit. It's a ram horn manifold. 60 1 turbo. 2200cc injectors on ethanol. This thing is cool. So you're still clowning? Yeah. Woo! It's wicked cool, man. This is tight, man. It's looking good. Thanks. Looks It's like you've been hard at work. We're on an eight, yeah. We're on an, a Honda S300. That looks like a transmission plug. Yeah, <laughs> I couldn't get it to stop leaking. Honestly, but that did it? Only got to stop leaking, yeah. Alright. Teflon. Uh, Teflon, I did a couple stuff and gas was still coming out. Oof. And that actually helped, so. Yeah, usually they take a little AN with a little O-ring. I did that, I did that too. You should have the O-ring and then the O-ring would go in. I did that too. Strange. And it was still leaking. Alright. Well, if you got it sealed up now, We'll get in there and check it all out and make it all work. All right, so we just changed the plugs, got some iridiums in there with the Burton kit. And Jamie's just found the boost control stuff. It's hooked up a little backwards, so he's checking that all out. I just flipped them at the solenoid, so it's right now. It's right now. Um, Beat to the bottom. Beat the bottom. Solenoids. Speed factories are different. Just whatever solenoid you get, you look up. The that diagram, solenoid. yeah. It's a regular picture right here. Yeah, well, and if it, the Speed Factory one is one of the first pictures that comes up and it's backwards for Mac. Um, so what are we wanting to do boost control wise? Because this will be just the gate, since you don't have a boost control in here. He doesn't have a boost kit in the ECU. He has the boost kit right in his hand. I mean, I have a soldering stuff. I got the boost controller all hooked up now, so we're going to jump in here and we're going to make a base pull, see where we're at, and start feeding her some duty and try to find some power with this bad boy. Like she wanted to keep going. Yeah, I hit like a limiter right here or something. I don't know what I hit. Okay. Not sure what I hit. What RPM was that? 
right, so I hung on to the limiter just so I could get a picture of what what's turning it on. I may have to save the file or put it in. It may be corrupt. It may just be a corrupt file, so I may have to just look at it again. Definitely some sort of early limiter. Tune up I had my computer that was close to the setup, I put it in there and I just played with the attention to fix it up and then took it off. So I'm gonna still trim it out a little bit and then film some stuff. Yep. Sounds like a plan to me. Alright, we added some boost control. Let's see how this DA will do. Let's go. Ah! Got that boost control going? laid on on you in there yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to check out here because I swear I hear a whistle okay we're gonna check for whistlers uh, the pup was just out the dump tube Filled in these boost numbers here. Try to fill in that hole. So that's the hole he's trying to fill in the boost control. And now we're going to go ahead and make a tug. See if it'll carry that power through. Boost was that? Six fifty. Six fifty. So we had a oh, we had a high of twenty four pounds, and then seventeen at the top. Six fifty. And that initial hit is what's going to murder the clutch. He's like, come on, <laughs> come on, Craig. That, that initial power right there at the hit will just destroy it. Well, we made a little more power than we were after. A little more than we should. So, I went ahead and backed it down. I'm gonna try to level it off. I had a big boost spike on the ramp coming in. And, uh, I mean, the motor can take it. It's built right, but... 
Fire in the middle is all I heard. Yeah, I heard it too. They, everything looked really good though. No, no. So just yeah. Gaps in. Let's look at this log. Alright, so time came out of it. There's a high of 21 pounds right there. So it's still ramped in kind of hard, and then we came back down to around 19, it looks like. 18 5 at the very tip. So pretty much what we're after. Go ahead and center that way and yeah. let her rip. This will be one of the and try it again. Oh, yeah. So, 629 is where I left it off. He's gonna go home and enjoy the crap out of it. Whew. Thing got down. What a rad little ride. Ain't nobody clowning now. <laughs>